Christmas lives get shorter every year. The things I want can't be bought with currency. Gifts can't hold you or get to know you, show you their heart or say I love you. I can't lean on intangibility. The thought of it just being me Where's the joy the holiday brings Oh, it's gonna be a sad cold Christmas Cause I don't got all I need You are necessity And just don't wanna be alone Standing underneath the little tree If my love ain't next to me oh. I guess I know what the lonely do at Christmas They go to the club Looking for love You know what I had, love But I lost it I don't even know how I got here. But to be honest, actually I do. Here I am, just trying to be myself. It's a crazy world, looking to find my place and all they do. True Perfection Hair Salon. Hey. Hey, I left the address. <laughs> yeah, let me go check. Why do you always forget stuff? Brush it. No, that is. Yeah. How are things going? It's going good. All right. I'm at your station now. Okay, I'm not sure where it is. Check the counter or the door. Do you even remember what it looked like? Fire for a business maker? Wait, it's right in my face. Is it Mocha First Friday? Yeah, yeah, that's it. Yeah, party with a purpose? That. <laughs> Hosted by... Can't spill it? Yeah, that's him. Yeah. I just missed the address. Um, it's 3555 Texas Drive, Houston, Texas, 77060. Girl, thank you so much. You're welcome. <laughs> thank you. All right. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Hmm. Hmm. I told you, a business mixer, always a good idea. Hey, just look at this turnout. Yeah, but I don't know about all these strangers in my house. Ah, just relax, they're all professionals. Besides, it gives them a chance to see the dope architect you are. Excuse me. Yeah, everyone is for H&H Man, yeah. will you stay positive? They said they were coming. Relax. All right, you haven't steered me wrong yet, but won't ever. So look, you ready to get started? Yeah, I'm just waiting on a few more people. Mm -hmm. Not about you, you want? Yeah, you are something else. <laughs> Listen, I invited this girl, right? Yeah. She is gorgeous, man, I hope she comes. Oh, yeah, what does she do, bro? A pediatrician, you know how I do. Oh, so I see what you trying to do. Trying to make a rendition of the Cosby Show, huh? A doctor and a lawyer? I see you, play Well, I don't know about all of that, but I would not mind showing her a different world. Ooh, then where you come from? Mm. <laughs> Wouldn't mind seeing where she's keeping her business cards at. Your Honor, please permit me to treat this witness as hostile. <laughs> I'll be back. <laughs> You're okay, man. Hey, Tasha. Hey. So, what's the tea you on chance? I know that's why you called me. First Friday. <laughs> what's that? I mean, for bougie people who think they're all that. And I should care why? Hosted by... Chance Phillips. <laughs> so he's hosting parties now? I don't know. But you know he never lets us know what he's really doing. Hmm. So he can invite a whole bunch of strangers to his house, but we can't know where he stays? We do now. 
if that's in fact his real address. Well, there's only one way to find out. Man, look, they ain't going to the league, bro. That was the best thing that could have happened to him. Man, that was crazy, man. I'm so proud of him, man. man. Like you said, man, crazy. Yes, indeed. Man. I can't wait to see him in the playoffs, bro. Man, that shit's going to be crazy, bro. Yes, yes indeed, man. Oh, God. Hello, how you doing? Hi. Excuse me for a second, blue guy. I'll say first. Hmm. Hello. Oh, hi. Are uh, you lost? No, I was just admiring the house. Well, you're supposed to be mixing and mingling. This is my first time at a mix and mingle. I'm kind of like a fish out of water. Well, the first thing you're supposed to do is introduce yourself by stating your name and what it is you do. Hmm. I'll go first. My name is Chance Phillips. I'm an architect and owner of Phillips Construction. Hmm. I've been in business for about five years now. Now it's your turn. I'm Gabrielle Dupree, and I'm not an entrepreneur yet, but thinking about it. Well, it's nice to meet you, Miss Dupree. It's nice to meet you, too. Mm. I hate it to me. How about we revisit how you feel about me after our date to Berlin? Mm. Well, I'm sure I have you out of my system by then. Oh, of course. Yeah, but you know, just in case. Yeah. <laughs> Man, I really, really love this house. Oh, yeah? Yes, it captivated me, like, the moment I walked in. Really? Yes, I love well, uh, it. Well, you are talking to an architect. I mean, a house like this isn't that difficult to build. I seriously doubt someone who's only been in business for five years could build something like this. Mm. Hmm, is it an overcast right now? Is that a little shade that you're throwing? <laughs> God, you are it. so funny. You are ridiculous. You know, but like, <laughs> got a little goosebumps and stuff on it's you. It's a little chilly. It's a little chilly right now. You want to take it to the house, you know? I mean, you could always give me a jacket. Yeah, but I don't like you like that. <gasps> oh. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Good evening, everyone. Okay, well, let's go. Yeah. Yeah. Good yes. evening, everyone. <laughs> I hate right. you. Welcome to First Fridays, where all of the young movers and shakers of this city come to share ideas and build our businesses. Yes. In the words of the great man Malcolm X, the future belongs to those who prepare for it today. So let's get money today so that we can give it tomorrow. Everybody put your drinks in the air. All right? Now repeat after me. Get it today. Get it today. Give it tomorrow. Give it tomorrow. Get it today. Give it tomorrow. Give it today. And give it tomorrow. Let's go, DJ. Get this party off. Get some numbers. Thank you for coming. All right. Hey, Gabrielle. So glad you made it. Hey, Good to see you. Yes, thanks for inviting me. Yes, and that was amazing. You like that? Yeah, it was awesome. Thank you. Yes, and the, this house. Oh, it is so nice. Well, yes. You're talking to the owner and the architect. Chance built it himself. Wait, you built this house? Oh, you built this house? <laughs> you know what? You might as well go on and pick your face up off the floor. That's right. no way to start off this relationship. Mm. Wait, oh, right. relationship? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but you know what, um, I may have to work a little harder mm. just to win that heart. <laughs> hey, hey, man, Chance, brother, What's hold that? on, man, this was the girl mm -hmm. I was telling you about earlier. Oh, that's Huxtable, that's Claire Huxtable. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, okay. So I see you two have met. Oh, yes, Chance is a big flirt. Oh, is he? Mm -hmm. Hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yes, we're going on a date tomorrow night. Oh, no. right? date, Chance? Really? <laughs> God, just doesn't waste any more time, huh? Before Chance just <laughs> goes right in for the kill. What's right that? in. <laughs> you know what? This party, though, is a whole vibe, but mm. I hate that I have to leave. Wait, but wait, you just got here. Mm. Yeah, where, where you going? I have to go to my great grandma's birthday party. 
She's turning 90 and I promised that I would make it, so. You know, but it is a beautiful thing to see all of these business owners in one room. It is inspiring, for real. Excellence personified, mm. right? Yes. You mind if I walk you out? Of course. Bye, Lex. I'll see you later again, man. Yeah, bye, Lex. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, hit him again. Yeah, hit him again. Later. Yeah, you're stupid. And you. <laughs> oh, you. Your directions suck. Everybody else seemed to get here on time, and they were all right. So. I got it. Because as far as I'm concerned, this neighborhood doesn't even exist. You want to know why? Because GPS, Alexa, or Google could not leave me here, okay? Oh! And I got in this whole argument with Siri where she's like, you have arrived at your destination. And do you know where I was, Alex? <laughs> in front of a tree. I said, Heffa, how did I make it to my destination? All right, brother, you seem a little stressed, me God. No, what I need uh, is a plug because my battery died trying to get here and I almost didn't even make it. <laughs> and you, and you, let me tell you something. Who the hell told you to build a house in the middle of Wakanda? Forever. Huh? Listen, don't blame my house for your lack of... Oh, my little man, get your hand off my lip. Man, don't blame my house for your lack of timeliness, man. And your tardiness, you miss Alex's speech, bro. It was inspiring, man. And save me with all that fake flattery, you Judas. Damn, it's like that, bro. Man, how you gonna go behind my back and steal my girl? Oh, oh say it ain't so, Chance. Man, bro, you know the code? Bros with a hoe. Man, come on, bro. You know it ain't even like that between us, man. You know that I've been digging on that girl since college. Mm. Damn. <laughs> I'm sorry. Stop. I'm sorry. I mean, but, you but, learn. but, Alex, what has taken you so long? I mean, she's not that type of girl, and I didn't want to make my moves on her like that. Plus, I was in that situation. <clears throat> wait, wait, situation? You talking about your marriage, bro? When has uh, marriage ever stopped you before? Isn't that why you're getting a divorce? <laughs> You got burned, you drunk daddy. Man, no, <laughs> you got burned. Jokes, okay. No more. <sighs> listen, listen, Chance. Clearly, Alex is butthurt about this whole female situation. So, mm -hmm. out of respect for your homeboy, maybe you shouldn't go out with her. Wait, wait, wait. What? I shouldn't go out with her. Right. I should pass up on a beautiful, successful woman because this clown put her in the friend zone. Damn. I'm Twice. Okay. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. But. Why would you do something so stupid? Because exactly. out of respect for my wife, I didn't take it there. That's okay. why. Press pause. When did he start respecting his wife? <laughs> <laughs> Two birds, you drunk patty. <laughs> Man, later for y'all. It doesn't even matter because you're going to make it up to me. I'm going to make it up to you. That's right. What? Listen, you're going to take us to State 48 and so on you. Now listen, hold up. State 48 is too expensive to be bringing a dude out there, man. See the State 48? First 48, your choice. How you like your steak cook, bro? Well done. Okay. CEO, my title, my videos go viral. Stop, 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 stop. That's it right there. That's it right there. <laughs> Man, ain't no way chance living like this. How can he afford this? Nah, th this gotta be the wrong address. This gotta be the wrong house. Nah, <laughs> this is the house. Ronnie said his daddy had a big old house. But we don't even know if this is the right house, though. Like, how do how do we even know that? What? There's only one way to find out. Let me tell y'all something. <laughs> it's as if the Lord himself made this thing with his own two hands. On to him, bro. Right off the cross. Excuse me, wait, wait, wait. What kind of thing is that? Hmm? Angus? <laughs> Kobe? Maybe LeBron? <laughs> wait, bro, listen. Any red flags I need to know about Gabriel? Um, see. She's smart. Mm -hmm. Sexy. That's for sure. Super <laughs> successful. Yeah. That's the reason why I was saving it for myself. Alex! Let it go. You lost. Yeah, um, Look. Just don't break a heart. Man, come on, man. I'm not that dude anymore, bro. 
I gave my life to Christ. And plus, I made a vow of abstinence, man. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Now you're going too far. <laughs> you're going too far, man. There's no more meat on the bone, bro. How did you even eat it that fast? H&H &H Holmes just messaged me and said that they apologized for missing the event. Okay. But they want to schedule an interview with us. Ha <laughs> ha, that's what I'm talking about, man. Yes, uh, indeed. Hold on. Who's H&H &H Holmes? Uh, a bunch of Christian developers. They're looking at Chance's company to build a subdivision. Yeah, man, I'm talking about 200 custom-built homes. Really? 200. Ooh. Gentlemen, that <laughs> is a bag. You know what I'm saying? It is, indeed. <laughs> you need it. Wait. What you mean I need it? <laughs> you have a council, oh. Okay, I mean, I mean, you got enough to maybe make it through the holidays. But gentlemen, we gotta make a move quick. Listen, man, I'm working on a few accounts now. I got a couple of contracts rolling, but uh, H&H &H Homes, that's the big fish. Go on, set up that meet, bro. All right, bro. Man, I don't know about this. On. What you see? Oh my God! A fish tank? How did this fool afford a fish tank? Hmm. We gotta see what the rest of this house look like. There's only one way to find out. Now you're getting it. Now we just gotta figure out the code. Oh, that's easy. It's my birthday. <laughs> Oh, you're serious, honey. No, um, what's Diamond's birthday? April 4th. <gasps> oh, we're in. Look at this house. What's your availability? Whenever they're available. I need that bag. Uh -huh. Wait, hold on. How's that movement at my front door? Oh, you got cameras installed, right? Hold on, I do. That's probably just some late comers to the mix. Whoa, wait, too many. Is that? Bruh. Monet. Who's that? What? Is that Tasha? Man, how the hell did they get my address, man? You know, I ain't saying what. Oh, look at me. Man, what the hell? Another move. What the hell are y'all doing in my house? Is that the bonus? Nah! That's chance! 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 How do you get a big house like this? With a fish tank! Hey, you little hush up, you little hood rats! Listen, this is attorney Alex Walker. And you're trespassing. You got about 10 seconds to vacate the premises or you will be arrested. Ten, <laughs> nine, eight, seven, six. And they're gone. Just like I thought. What the hell, Lex, bro? Calm down. Relax. Man, listen, I got too much going on in my life right now for my past to be showing up at my front door. But just send me the copy of the video and I'll file for a restraining order in the morning. All right? Man, listen, man, I gotta go check on my house. Just mm -hmm. I'm gonna get out of here. I'm gonna take care of the bill on my way out. That'll be easy, man. Look, make no. sure you take care of the bill. Take Shut care up, of that man. bill. Oh, Tom. <laughs> Between you and me? Huh? Chances baby mothers are the worst. I understand that. Facts. Facts. Do you really think a couple of white dollar conservatives are really gonna hire a brother? I mean, Chance is their top candidate. All it really has to do is pass an interview and a background check. Wait, his financials are in order, right? Yeah, of course. Of course. Oh, he's gonna smash the interview. Yeah, I'll put it. Alex. We both know. It's not the end of you, we're concerned about. Chance is playing us. We gotta find a way to get more money out of him. Well, Chance already give us money every month. I say if it's not broke, why well, fix it? <laughs> the only people that are broke are us. How are you broke? When well, you got a man and a side piece paying your bills. Yeah but I don't have kids with them. The state will make Chance pay. The state? 
Mm -hmm. I thought we promised not to put Chance on child support. What do you mean a state? <laughs> How many promises has Chance broken to us? He even promised to marry you. Oh, please, I know that. Cap. <laughs> you messed up. You caught feelings and got pregnant. Don't you got a baby bottom too? <laughs> the difference between me and you is that it's always been about the money for me, mm. not love. I don't care nothing about Chance and his feelings. I gave up a lot for him. And he doesn't get to just move on and leave me with nothing. <laughs> so what you gonna do, huh? I know how to get his attention. And you're gonna help me. <laughs> you both go. Love it, right? And how would you like your eggs? Poached, please. No, okay. scramble for me. Yeah. All right, coming right up. Oh, so delicious. Thank you. What, you want to say grace? Oh, yeah, let's do that. Let's do it. God bless this food. Let it nourish our bodies in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Man, this is so different. Different? Wait, you never had chicken and waffles before? Yes, I mean, church is a thing. And now this? Well, I mean, <laughs> before I do anything, I bring it to God. So, uh, I'm to bring you to church. I had to make sure you weren't a heathen. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you passed that test, so you know, I figured I'd feed you a little bit. Come on, church was a test? Absolutely. You know what? I didn't know I was in school, Professor Chan. Get your notebook. <laughs> what about you, Dr. Gabrielle Dupree? Well, I didn't always want to be a doctor. Mm. I started as a law student. That's how I met Lex. Mm. Mm -hmm. So, uh, what made you change your mind? Life. But I know it was the right path for me. I finished med school and then my dream job was to work at Texas Children's, but when I got hired, I just, I don't know, I i thought I was gonna feel a you know, sense of fulfillment, but mm -hmm. I didn't. Well, why not? It limited my ability to help children. Mm. I mean, I can only help the kids whose parents have good health insurance. Mm -hmm. And less fortunate, they're just serviced at a different level. So by less fortunate, you mean African-Americans? All minorities. And I don't know, that's why I want to start my own practice. I don't have to turn anybody away. I know what it's like to not have good medical insurance and have to seek care by other means. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, um, looks like you have everything together with your career and all that. Why not pursue it? Well, I have the name of the business and my business group. Okay, well, so what's the name? Angels Children Center. Angels? Gabrielle. Angel. <laughs> <laughs> look, I got it. I'm not that slow. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you look a little slow with this chicken grease on your face. Oh. Let me get you. <laughs> <laughs> look, I even found the location too, but I'm just a little bit disappointed because I have to omit my indoor playground that I really wanted. Hmm. Well, uh, why don't you let me build it for you? My playground? The care center. Wait, you can do that? See, like, I'm sick of you doubting me. Did you Wait. get the part of you doubting me? Like, <laughs> no, on, listen, man. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to offend you, but can you, have you ever built a children's center before? Absolutely. Sure I can. It's a piece of cake. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> See, you play too many games. <laughs> All right, and here we go. Your eggs are ready. Oh, wait, hold on. Yeah, Janice, she uh -huh. asked for post eggs. She's gonna get and eat what's in front of her. There are homeless and starving people, and you up here worried about her bougie poached eggs. Oh, it's okay. It's okay, really. I can I can eat these. It's fine. Yeah, it's it's fine. No, no, no. You have to stop settling. Janice will cook your eggs just like you want enough. For your information, I already cooked her poached eggs when she asked for them. Hmm. Wow. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Thank you. I just wanted to see how she handles this appointment. <laughs> it was just a test. <laughs> well, did she pass? Of course, with flying colors. <laughs> Wait, huh? what is going on? 
Gabrielle, I would like to introduce you to Janice, my mother. Oh my God, this is your mother? <laughs> oh my God, it is so nice to meet you. It's nice to meet you too. Listen, I was just joking about all that stuff. <laughs> you are actually a very sweet-spirited girl. Thank you. I'm proud of you, Chance. You did good. She's a keeper. I like her. I like her too. <laughs> well, you two go ahead and enjoy your brunch and y'all call me if y'all need anything. <laughs> You set me up. Well, you know what? I gotta watch you. You sneaky. Mm -mm. No intention. <laughs> I know what I want. What do you want, Chance? Well, I want us to date exclusively. Look, Gabrielle, I like you, and um, I just don't want any outside interference. Oh, someone is afraid of a little competition. Got it. No. Uh... I'm not afraid of any competition. I just don't want to waste your time on mine. I can respect and agree to that. I also want to build your child care center, just the way you envisioned it. Oh, 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 wait, hold on. If our relationship goes south, will my center go with it? Listen, our relationship is personal. And that center is business. And I'll continue to treat it as such. OK. You cannot be this perfect. <laughs> I mean, I think I am. You know, pretty much I am. You know? Wow. Okay. Um. So that means we go together now, right? <laughs> well, yeah, in a Francis W. Gregory Jr. High School type <laughs> of way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what? So let me let me propose a toast <clears throat> to my new business and my new boo. <laughs> in my eye with the love all around it feels so right and I will take this opportunity to share you there's no way that I could ever repay you cause I am surrounded by all the people I love there's no reason to cry cause I know that you will hold us I can feel the presence all around me If love was made of water, I'd be drowning I'm grateful that I'm here and that you found me The way you showing love is astounding Keep this moment Keep the caught with the repeat on it Keep it on What's up, Tom? What's up? Uh, She's not going. What you mean she's not going? Not until we talk. What you mean we? What you, what are you talking about? Oh my God, for real? Hey, Chance. I like your new little outfit. I guess you got some new clothes to go with your new house. Listen, whatever it is y'all have going on right now, I don't have time for it. Oh, you better make time if you want to see your kids. All right, what do y'all want now? A raise, Chance. You're doing better, so your kids need to do better. Look, me doing better is beneficial for my kids, whom I take excellent care of, by the way. And on top of that, I give both of y'all a thousand dollars a month. <laughs> That's not enough. Two thousand dollars is nothing to Mr. Party Promoter, Entrepreneur, or whatever it is that you do. How much money do you make now, anyway? Look, that's none of your business. I just came in for my kids and I'm ready to go. You can't see them. Not until you pay us each $5,000. 5000 Money, have you lost your mind? No. I'm not about to pay y'all $10,000 a month. Look like a ball player or something. I own a small business and that's it. <laughs> I don't care how you get it. I know you got it, though. You never cared how I got it as long as I shared it with you. But the bottom line is, I'm not paying y'all that much money. I'm not about to turn into y'all new little scam. Okay, well, what about your kids? What about my kids? You obviously don't care about them or the life I can finally, finally provide for them. You know I care about those kids. Oh, really? 
by taking their father out of their lives and ruining their Christmas for them? Oh, our kids are gonna have an amazing Christmas. The child support office Ch is gonna make sure that Child happens. support? You heard That's me. what we doing now? Yep. <sighs> okay. Look, tell my kids I love them. And you. I expect something like this out of her, but you? Stop trying to manipulate Tasha. Those days are over, but... Can we go with Dad now? He's gone. Is he coming back? Your father doesn't want to be in your lives anymore. That's not true. My <laughs> father would never do that to me. Yeah, Mom, I don't believe you. Down to go in the house about You talking back? No, I'm not talking back. Go get in the car! You just told those kids that their father doesn't want to be in their life anymore. That was really harsh. Until my bank account says otherwise, it's the truth. You should have been a comedian instead of an architect. Oh, no, I'll stay way away from show business. I'll just stick to building custom homes. Plus, I'm good at it. You really are. I love your house. And your presentation today was just incredible. Well, thank you. I have an amazing team. In light of that, we would like to meet Hang you on, and... Hang on, slow down, sweetheart, okay? okay. Chance, what's going on, man? I love your floor plans. Okay. They're unique, creative, exactly what we're looking for. Okay. But to move forward, we're gonna need your financials. Okay. We're gonna need a background check. Not a problem. And assuming there's no red flags, then we'll send you a contract. Okay. Man, listen, this is a red flag free zone. And plus, I'm a Democrat. <laughs> yeah, Democrat. Well, that's funny, but nobody's perfect. <laughs> Well, listen, I'll see you guys at the Christmas party, correct? You absolutely will. Awesome. Count awesome. On. Awesome. Well, I'll walk you guys out. <laughs> God is good, you hear me? Man, bro, that went awesome. Man, I knew they was going to be eating out the palm of my hand, especially the man. I started cracking jokes with that stuff like that. <laughs> yes, indeed, man. I got this in a bag, bro. You hear me? <laughs> Now, come on, man. Y'all supposed to be excited for your boy. Why y'all looking at me like that, man? What's up? I don't know. <laughs> Chance, maybe because your jokes suck. Oh, how about oh, the fact that you said that there were no red flags? Really, Chance? Bro, you gonna stop hitting me, man. But just look, just relax, man. Alex and his crush are gonna take care of that for me. It's sponges take time, Chance. On, and how's man. Gabrielle gonna help you fix your background? Gabrielle, that's for me, partner. I'm talking about Carolyn. Carolyn? Carol? Oh, hell no. Oh, wait, 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 Are you serious? Wait, Carolyn? Yeah. From the records department from downtown. The, that's her. Shh. With the She's mold. got a thing. Well, Alex. Get it out of here. <laughs> she is in love with this dude. This. Y'all, this is great. It's not great. Y'all are tripping. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Bro, I've done the numbers. This is a multi-million dollar deal that we need, okay? You gotta take one for the team. Take one for the team. Don't listen. Come on, man. Come on, man. Listen, 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 just sweet talk her, bro. You know, finesse the situation like you always do. Man, she's gonna want me to finesse even more than the situation, Chance. Yes, Look, come on, man. It's not that bad. Hey, look, you kinda looks like Lady Gaga, man. She looks like Lady Uh-Uh. Yeah, I, I wouldn't say that. I said she looks more like Lady Eloise. <laughs> <laughs> man, come on, listen. Hey, Alex, listen, bro, listen. Look, look, look at me. I need you, man. I need you in the situation, bro. Come on, Alex. You got it. You can, you can do it. You can do it. He's thinking about it. He's thinking about it. Here we go with it. That is. That is. That is. All right. All right. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Okay. 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 
right. Yeah, yeah. But I'm charging you the big Texas full size. Alex ain't never lost the case price on this one. Oh, Chance. Lord, Alex. You don't have to blow your own horn. <laughs> You can let Carolyn do that for you. I hate your face. Okay. And I hate your face. Okay, 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 okay. God. Okay, let's look, let's look at the bright side. Yeah. Bright side. I'm sure she can take her teeth out of <laughs> No, 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 no. Look, listen, the real bright side is you're about to get this money, man. Now let's go celebrate, man. Get it, steak 48. No. I'm not taking you to steak 48 again. You embarrass me. Well, we, we, we got it. You got it, especially since Alex. <laughs> I'm sorry, Alex. Okay, okay, okay. Like, I'm yeah, sorry. Yeah, like, I'm sorry. Man. I'm this close to joining the KKK. Oh, but listen. Okay, okay. I'm sorry. Good if one. I could trade places with you, listen to your brother. If I could, you wouldn't. I wouldn't. I know. <laughs> Get off of me. Hello, Alex. Ellie, I'll drive, man. Let's Why go. Why are you touching? Let's go, I'm man. You invaded Ellie my personal empty. space. This is assault. <laughs> I'm getting you audited. Ladies, the weather's nice today, considering it was freezing yesterday. It is, but I hear it's supposed to be like 40 degrees again tomorrow. <laughs> oh, you know how Houston is with this bipolar weather. That's right. That's why I'm always sick, shoot. <laughs> what are you over there so giddy about? I'm texting Chance. He is such a sweetheart. Chance, you've been spending a lot of time with this Chance guy. I have, and it has been wonderful. Wonderful. <laughs> Do tell. Girl, I don't know, but it is giving me forever vibes. Oh, how are you getting forever vibes from a man we haven't met yet? That part. Give me his yeah. last name. I'm running that background check. Phillips. His last what? name is Phillips. Phillips. Danielle. Brittany, don't. Why not? You're in love, right? <laughs> yes, I believe I am. <laughs> <sighs> you are? Like, for real? <laughs> yes. No, 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 no. no. I'm running a credit, uh, too. Wait, no, Brittany, don't. Give me Stop. Back. No, I'm not. Uh, Run it. Stop. Wait. You know what? I it can't. Looks. Both of y'all are on the same team. When are we meeting this Chance guy? The first Friday in December. Look, okay, so Chance and his partners host this business mixer the first Friday of every month. Mm -hmm. So... I'll invite you to then, and you'll just meet him at the mix. Mm. <laughs> so you're in love, in love. Okay, Liz, are you guys ready to run before the temperature drop? Uh -huh. Yes, please. please. Yes. <laughs> God in a good shot, what? And but anyway, she told me that she had a dream. She's blind. Last time the whole argument. I just did it. Anyway, new stripes. Oh, Chan, are you coming to the game with us tonight? Oh, no, nah, man, I'm going out with my baby dad, man. You know, I talked to her earlier. Yeah. The feeling. Hey, the feeling is mutual, man. Hey, you know, I spent Thanksgiving with her and her parents, huh? The parents? Yes, sir. Hey, you don't think that's too soon? Too soon? Come on, man. I'm getting old, bro. It's time to settle down, man. <laughs> I hear that, bro. There ain't nothing out here but them horns and them heartbeats, okay? <laughs> that's it. Anyway, does that sound like wedding bell in the air? Damn. Hey, for real, for real. I mean, Gabrielle could definitely be the next Mrs. Phillips. Okay. Oh, well, yeah. All right. That's what's up. I'm mad at What you mean you're not mad at Say. All right, let's go. You don't have to keep telling me I'm strikes. I know I'm strikes, but that's damn. What's up? All I'm saying is, I had a dream with Gabrielle. Okay. But, I was out there reckless. I'd probably just break her heart just like I did my wife, so. Honestly, you're the best man for her. You hit this dude? This can't be the Alex. I know you all right, bro? Yeah. What? Oh. Oh, my God. Oh. <laughs> Oh, wait. I know. I know. Girl, it's so pretty today. It is. But uh, <laughs> what we need to be talking about is uh, you and Chance. So, uh, any red flags? No. 
Well, when I tell you, he has been the perfect gentleman. Like, even my parents love him. <laughs> you know, my daddy don't like nobody. Now, that's true. He <laughs> don't like anybody at all. Um, so, have you told him that you don't like him? Not yet. Why? Because it hasn't come up yet. That's something that you need to share with him. I mean, maybe it could be a deal breaker. I know. And I'm going to tell him. Yeah. You need to tell him soon. Are you done? Mm -hmm. All right. Let's go. How's Gabrielle feel about your kids? She doesn't know about her. <clears throat> you haven't told her? Nah. Why not? <laughs> she gonna break up with him, that's why. Shut up, man. You're only gonna break up with me behind that, man. Well, then how come you haven't told her? What, you embarrassed? Of course not, man. I'm not ashamed of my kids, man. <laughs> you just don't want to bring her in that drama with everything going on with my baby mama's right now. Yeah, but your kids are the most important part of your life. She should know that, man. Fix that. The only man that Gabrielle needs to know about is the man that I am now. How is she really going to know you if you don't tell her everything? Everybody makes mistakes, right? Okay, hold on, counsel. <laughs> yeah, everybody makes mistakes, but Chance made two. Two bad things. Chance, your baby mamas are terrible. They're terrible and they're awful, awful people. They're terrible and awful people. You shouldn't even matter. They're, they're very terrible people in the world. I don't know if you could have gotten them terrible. <sighs> I'm just saying, it's sustained. But it don't matter how your kids came with this work. It's still a blessing, and you take care of your kids. That's commendable. Hey, speaking of which, bro, listen, we need to put some pressure on that man. Okay, as Christmas is around the corner, and I want to spend it with my kids. All right, I got a couple, but listen, this is one day at a time. I'm still trying to work on Miss Carol. Oh, yeah? <laughs> Speaking of that, Carol, what about Miss Carolyn and you? How was it? You were asking him that, man. It was an honest question. Honest answer. It was not as bad as that. On that note, I'm out of here. You want to get ready for the night? <laughs> Come on, man, that's not right. <laughs> Seven is the new 30. Chance, baby, I'm here. What's up, baby? Listen, go ahead and meet yourself at home. I'll be on the minute, okay? Okay. There my man go. Oh, baby, you look so good. Good, don't mm -hmm. let, me see. See. let me see. Let me see, let me see. Uh-huh, yeah. You yeah. Me? Watch that side. Let side. me see. Mm -hmm. <laughs> time for the homies, though. Everything, mm -hmm. yes, yeah. baby. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Come on, they ain't ready for you. <laughs> <At all. laughs> Damn, you look good. Mm. <laughs> uh. <laughs> um, Sir, what's up? Where is your Christmas spirit? Where is the tree, the lights, decoration? Probably at home, girls. Cause I <laughs> suck at decorating. But maybe you can help me with that. You know I'd love to. That's what's up. Well, listen, what what was it you wanted to talk to me about? It sounded important. We can discuss it over dinner. Okay, okay. Well, listen, our dinner reservations on for another hour, and I called you over here because uh, I got something I want to show you. Okay. You have a seat. <laughs> uh. What you want to show me? This is a sketch for Angels Children's Care Center. This is my building? Yes, ma'am. 30,000 square feet. And look, this is what it will look like once it's finished. Oh, my God, Chance. This is amazing. Oh, oh wow. Keep scrolling, keep scrolling. Oh, <laughs> wait, hold on. You made the waiting area into an indoor playground just like I wanted. Yes, ma'am. You have captured everything I envisioned so vividly, baby. 
Well, isn't it my job to make your dreams come true? Chance Phillips, you are something else. You are really trying to make me fall in love with you. You want in love with me already? It's all good, it's all good. I guess I'm in love alone over here. Look, go down and keep scrolling. Wait, I didn't say I wasn't in love with you. Well, are you? Well. Go ahead, wait, just, just hold that thought. <laughs> go down to the next slide. Oh, they are adorable. Whose kids are these? Oh, cute. They're mine. Wait a minute, you have kids? Were you married before? Never been married. And um, my kids are from two different relationships. So you have two baby mamas? Yes. Okay, I think I'll take you up on that wine now. <laughs> I mean, how is your relationship? I mean, y'all, good terms, bad terms, still sleeping together? <laughs> no, no, and hell no. <gasps> My children's mothers are evil, vindictive demons from the pits of hell. So your baby mamas are problematic. Very problematic. Okay. But my kids are amazing though. And I haven't seen them in a few weeks because their mothers are being petty right now. Why don't you just take them to court so you can see your kids? Well, I'm not in the system. I pay the mothers directly. I believe that every dime that I pay for my kids should go to them and not the state. Do you mind me asking how much you give them each month? It's not a problem. Uh, I pay $2,000 a month, plus health benefits, mm. and school tuition. Mm. Gabrielle, oh. are you okay? It's hot in here, you hot? I'm good. More wine, please. Mm. Okay. Oh, I just feel like that's a lot, don't you think? Mm. Well, listen, if it makes any consolation for you, I make more than enough money to take care of my kids. Now, listen, this is all new information for you. How does this make you feel? No, I guess I know why you built this huge house. Well, this house, my business, my faith, and even the little changes I made in my life are all because of my kids. I don't know, just continue, I'm just thinking. About? Gabrielle, please just explain to me how you feel. Honestly, I don't want kids. You, you mean like ever? I don't even date guys who have kids. But this is different and a lot more complicated. I can understand that. I mean, listen, Gabrielle, I wouldn't want you to settle for anything less than what you deserve. I mean, but all I ask is that you let me down easy, because I don't know if I can handle that. Let you down? Chance, I love you. Did I just say that out loud? <laughs> yes, you did. You see that? Let me put this down. <laughs> Gabrielle, listen. I love you. I believe that we can have a future together. You just have to bend a little bit, that's all. <laughs> I know. You know, let's get out of here you're before right, I right. change my mind, Mr. <laughs> Two Baby Mama. Oh, 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 there you go with the jokes. <laughs> all right, we can go. Oh, with the jokes. Let's do it. You know what? I'm getting two desserts tonight. Ooh, two desserts? <laughs> two. That's right. Hey, I got you, you deserve it. Oh, I heard it. But I don't see it saving me. Pretty on a shelf, it's clear to see that I can see right through it. Looking so translucent, being all elusive.
friend. Yeah, Hi. who is your friend? <laughs> I'm Danielle Barnes. Nice to meet you. I yes. am so happy to finally meet you, Alex. I, I admire your work. Thank you. Yeah, I just recently passed the bar. Oh my goodness. Oh, we have so much in common already. And how is that? <laughs> oh, Danielle. Uh, I recently passed out at the bar. Oh. Ladies, yeah, please. Oh, please. Smith just like my grandmother. Just like white diamonds and mothballs. Take me home. Take me home. And you look like Halle Berry, too. Come forth. Here you go. For you. That's three. And this. <laughs> That's me. Oh, my God. <laughs> Girl, I cannot. A little strange, but he's kind of cute. Oh, girl, listen, no, that's a phase that only a mother could. Oh, you <laughs> <laughs> have you ever heard from Ricky? Yeah, she texted, she said she was gonna be late. But uh, when do I get to meet this Mr. Chance guy? I am <laughs> eager to meet the man that's been making you smile from ear to ear these past few months. Well, he is eager to meet you guys too. You and Brittany are my final approvers. If y'all give Chance the green light. I know he's a woman. Well, I'm already impressed because this house is fire. I know, right? And I've never seen you glow like this. I've never met a man like this. I want to tell you, he is literally everything I've prayed for in the <gasps> There's that glow again. Girl. I mean, well, it is Christmas. How long have you been listening, sir? I just this one. Ooh, just, just, and he was smiling from ear to ear too. <laughs> I take it this is Chan. Yes, and you are? I'm Danielle. Thank you. Oh, okay, it's nice to meet you, Danielle. You've been on my baby since the third grade. Huh? That's all right. We're practically like sisters. I feel like I know you too because Gabby talked about you all the time. Oh, really? Hmm. I guess somebody's nose is wide open. Well, my nose better not be the only one wide open. So, uh, <laughs> what are your intentions, Chan? Ooh. You didn't warm me up or nothing. You just yeah. throw that right in there, huh? Just I mean, the thing is that Dr. Dupree is quite the catch, and I just want to make sure that you do right by her and that your intentions are pure. Well, I assure you, Danielle, that my intentions are very pure. You know what? I'd rather show you. And tell you. Okay, a man with a plan, girl. I like that. Girl. <laughs> That's what I yeah. Okay. you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm here. Oh, look who decides to show up. Don't you start. You were supposed to be here 20 minutes ago. Well, tell it to my GPS and let me find this place. Oh, and you must be out of prison. Not impressed. Uh, Ruby, this is Chan. My boyfriend. I know who he is. I said what I said. Um, Chance, baby, uh, can you give us one minute? I just need to have a brief conversation with him. What the hell is with you today? Yeah. That was rude. I don't care. Oh, you need to have a chat. Now, chat. Let's go. Okay, great. Hey, up? Listen, I get it. I understand Chance is your man, but he is not the man for you. How can you say that? You don't even know him. Oh, I found out everything I need to know about him. You do. And then. I didn't ask you to investigate him, Brittany. You didn't have to ask. I mean, I figured the relationship was serious enough for me to take a closer look into Sharon. Who is Sharon? Sharon Chance Phillips is his government name. I guess he didn't tell you that. <laughs> Baby, there's a lot. I'm sure Sharon didn't tell you. You see, I have tea to spill, but I'm not saying anything until I get your permission. Look, I already know he has two kids by two different women. And you're okay with that? Girl, his baby mamas, they the real deal. They're something trifle. Okay, is that all? No, that's not all. Chase <sighs> is a registered sex offender. What? Oh my God. Listen, it actually sounds worse than what it really is. What is worse than that? Okay, so the incident happened about 15 years ago. He urinated on a tree in a public park. Someone called the cops. Because children were in the area, he was exposed, he had to register. 
And he must have a hell of an attorney because those charges are in the process of being expunged. Nothing. No, Gabrielle, it's bad. There were other things on his record. Most of them are misdemeanors, but Chance has done some hard time. Wait, when? So he's never told you he's been to prison? No. What did he go to prison for? Fraud? Money laundering? Embezzlement? He went in in 2010, released 2012. And if it ever comes out that this business isn't legit, you well, know. Is it? Come on, I know you checked. Well, for now, all the certifications, bank accounts, that all checks out. See? Well, I feel nauseated. Gabby, listen, I am sorry. I know you really like Chance, but I just don't trust him. Look, those things happened a long time ago. But they still happened. And who's to say he's still not the same guy? And he didn't even tell her. Can I have everyone's attention, please? I want to thank you all for coming out to the very last first Friday of the year. And I hope you all made some very powerful and prosperous connections. Because I know that I have. And one of those connections that I made was extremely divine. It was with the lovely, talented, beautiful, Dr. Gabrielle Dupree. She is the woman that I love. The woman that I want to spend the rest of my life with. Gabrielle, would you make me the happiest man on this planet by becoming my wife? Oh. Dr. Dupree. Will you marry me? Oh my God, it's so beautiful. So cute. Oh. Will you marry me? Sharon, I mean, Chance, uh, the what? police are here. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Good evening, Mr. Phillips. Good evening, officer, is there a problem? Yes, there is. Apparently you're behind your child support payments. Child support? Yes, I thought you said you weren't in the system. I'm not in the system. You are now. Huh. And who are you anyway? She's my fiance. You ain't doing it. Officer, um... Frankie. Mr. Phillips is my client. And I would like to know what all of this is about. But before you explain, I have a restraining order that won't allow these women to be on this property. Get them out of here. I'm sorry, but y'all don't have to go. <laughs> now, what is this about? According to the state, Mr. Phyllis owes $30,000 of back child support. What? I have a warrant for his arrest. See that, man. <gasps> This is a mistake. I have received no. and bank statements that can confirm that Mr. Phillips does not owe this money. Lazarus, I'm already on it. I mean, if you can prove he's not a deadbeat, that's great, you know, but he's gotta go downtown. I'm sorry, turn around, please. No. Worry about anything, you know what have to do. Don't say anything, don't say Lazarus with that email. Sending it now. Come on. All right. Excuse me. Excuse me. Got it. Can you take care of the rest of the guests? Yeah, man. Just make sure I'm All right, cool. Mm -hmm. Gabrielle, come on. You're about a thing. Take care of it. Right? Okay. Get to the bottom of this. Don't worry. Okay. I told you. All right, y'all. Y'all know what that means. Stop. Not right now. Stop. Come on. Let's go. Hey, happy Christmas. <laughs> Merry Kwanzaa, whatever. Let's go. And exit that way. What is it? And that was a lot. I cannot believe what just happened. Okay, but at least we should be happy. Girl, we died to bullet. I feel so sorry for Chad. I hope he doesn't have to spend a night in jail. Girl, he's used to it. Okay? I'm sure he'll be okay. That is a beautiful ring. It's gotta be at least, what, three and a half carats, right? Mm-hmm. Too bad she has to get it back. You are gonna get it back, right? I'm undecided. What's that to decide? 
good things with it, with it, with it. Yeah. I mean, I don't wanna love this place, man. I love this place. Man, listen, $800 a month per kid and joint custody. Yes, sir. Um, yes. Legs, man. You showed him really helpless. Who was the man? Oh, you showed him no mercy. Listen, correction. Judge showed him no mercy. Hey, you slept with her too? I don't know, dummy. I just presented her with an airtight case and she had to come forward. All right. You're the man, Lex. You are the man. No. Nope. <laughs> hey, what's wrong with you, bro? But you just, you just got the deal of the century. You in here acting like you just lost your brand new puppy. Now listen, bro, I'm, I'm, I'm good. We still haven't heard from her. Yeah, I feel you. I know what it's like to lose somebody that you're in love with. The divorce is about to be final in 48 hours, just before Christmas. Yeah. No, 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 no. We're not doing that. Listen, y'all need to cut it. It is the holiday season. Look at us. What do you see? What's in here? Yeah. You see what's in here? Desperate women with no morals. Come on, man. Lighten up. Do not let negative Nancy ruin your whole night, bro. You know what? Uh huh. I think the boy got a point here. <laughs> no, yeah. I need to stop tripping and stop waiting on Gabrielle to call me, man. Yeah. Yeah, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna call her. Call her. And break up with her. If you, yeah, I'm gonna say it. Gabrielle. No, no, no. Doc. I'm canceling all of our appointments because I don't want you no more. No one. And on top of that, give me that ring back. Yeah, that's what I need. Mean. That set up brother pocket back a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh-huh. I need that ring. Hold on, wait. Laz, uh, I thought you said uh, Gabrielle gave you the ring to get back to Chance. Wait, 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 wait. Hold up. Wait. Put that drink down. Excuse me, sir. Gabrielle gave you the ring back? That's what he said. Where's it at, man? <laughs> Listen. I got it. Okay. Just, I ain't got it on. Okay. Uh, listen, bro, that's a ten thousand dollar ring. That's nothing to play with. Damn, jeez. Man, I wish I would have known that. I would have asked for a better deal. Where's the ring, Lazarus? Ray, Ray, pawn. Wait, wait, what? What? Ray, Ray, pawn and pawn shop, man. Man, you pawn my ring? Hey. Man, but you know you lost your mind? Yes, I'll just drop $10,000. What? I told you I kept you alone. Nah, Chance, man. <laughs> he gonna produce that. Oh, I know he gonna produce the ring, man. Or That's you ridiculous. Gonna, or you gonna sue him. Exactly. You gonna sue me? Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Man, pay attention, man. You know what? Hey, look. I'm not gonna let y'all ruin my night. With all this meat, with your paws running around in this club. You know, I'm gonna get you ready. I'm gonna get you ready. And I'm gonna bring it back to you. And when we come back, we ain't friends no more, understand me? Tables open, people. Man, Lazarus is gonna make me hurt him, bro. Mm. You know what, forget that, man. Listen, tell me some good news, man. Tell me you talked to H&H &H Holmes. Well, I gave them a statement about your arrest and the rule. Hopefully they sign the contracts so we can move on. I hope so. Man. These past few weeks have been extremely rough, man. Tell me, man. I'm just ready to get off this roller coaster and live my life. Well, look, thank you for always having my back. I'm just fulfilling my assignment. You assignment? What you mean, man? God told me that my assignment was to make sure that you prosper. Here's my issue with you, though, Chance. You never show your scars. You always hide your flaws, your past mistakes, the thing that God brought you through. But that's the reason why Gabby walked out of your life. But that's what I don't understand. If I'm supposed to be a new creature in Christ, then why bring up my past? The promiscuity, the present, the probation are all actual chapters in your story. I'm not gonna lie. I feel some kind of way about having your record expunged. Like, I'm glad it's expunged. I want it to be expunged. 
kind of feel some kind of way about it. Why? Because it hides the fact that you've been tried and proven. And you shouldn't hide that. And listen, everybody can handle my past. I've shared my past with people and I've lost friends and businesses because of it. Well, you need to decide who your audience is. Now, maybe your potential customers might not need to know your past, but there are men being released from prison every day. They need to see and hear how you trust God mm -hmm. and how you beat the odds. Do you think somebody in prison right now behind those bars actually believes that they can come out and attain all of this? I did. But that's because you had somebody helped. You're right, man. I had a dope mentor. And that's my point. It's time for you to be a mentor. Pay that forward. What happened to your boy? I haven't talked to him in a minute. It's been a while. Wait, weren't you supposed to link up with him with his non-father? Yeah, with everything else going on, I kind of dropped the ball in that whole situation. Yeah. Sometimes God takes people out of our life that we love, shake us up, and bring us back in focus. Thank God we moved Gabby from my life. I thank God it's Gabby to Get your attention. Sometimes he has a way of using beautiful women to bring us to our knees. You're right about that. Mm -hmm. Damn, speaking of, I gotta go holler at this divorce attorney. Uh, go handle that, man. I appreciate you, bro. Listen, go call your boy. I will, man. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Uh, My brothers, you gonna put your family back through that mental fortitude, that mental suffering that you was doing in there? Or you gonna come out and you gonna be an upstanding, upright person, understand the checks and balances of life? What you gonna do? Fist fighting in the street, drunk, full of that Hennessy? Around here, people are playing them women. You got a daughter out here. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't know when you come in here, I, I check your records before you come in here. I don't just allow you in my presence. Yeah. So I need you to understand, brothers, what you have to do once you come out of incarceration. This is when the real war starts. This is when you have to be positive. This is when you have to motivate yourself. This, this is a self-motivating institution right now. You, you are the institution. Did you understand that? Benny! Yeah, I'm on it because he was, yeah, shooting up, doing what he was doing. I don't understand this, but I want y'all to understand me. I was in there, and now I'm here trying to motivate him, trying to inspire. Has been, he didn't see me three times. So you still at it, huh? Oh, look at what the cat and drug in. Man, boy, it's good to see. Come here, man. Oh. Well, I thought you forgot about it. I did, man. I did. Listen, I'm here now. Hey. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. You know, you know. Hey, hey, you know, you, know, you, know, you, know, you, know, you know, got me a donation. I had to. Man, thank you, brother. Oh, man. Oh, man. You know something? I got, I got something to do. What you got? Me? Well, yeah, I had that. You're going to get over here and help me serve some of this damn food. What you going to do? You know what I'm saying? Hey, man, I, I, I think I'm beside myself. Fellas, listen, y'all don't even know what this is. This is Chance Phillips, man. A world-famous entrepreneur. This brother got the paper, giving donations. Just understand this. The mother was locked up with me. It used to be my former cellmate. Yeah. Yeah, let this be a, a lesson to you, Benny. What you can do if you stay positive, brother, stay prayed up. Oh, man. Man, this is inspiration, brothers. Hey, come on, man. Let me serve some of this food. Hey, man. Come on, man. Y'all get some these, man. Come on, man. Yeah. Beat it. Come on, man. Here we go. At the top of the class on the road. And it's time to run it up. Yeah, you know. Maxed out. Put the pedal to the flow. Hey, On the road. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah, we winning by a landslide. Never see me coming. I'm a landmine. Yeah, I ain't taking orders in command light. Yeah, you about to see me on demand light. You know on demand. If you ain't know, you about to understand. Yeah, I got the team by my side, right hand. Yeah, take it to a stream, you ain't seen it like that. Yeah, and it's the dream, and we coming for the bag. Yeah, and we ain't never going back now. If
future expedite and now we on the fast track now They won't lend a hand, now they see us on the map now It's time to act out Thank you, girl, for getting down before, man. I've been swamped. Yeah. Um, I came here to let you know that I'm not taking Ronnie or Diamond to Chance's house. Why? Because this ain't right. The judge ain't right. Joint custody ain't right. And $800 a month? Tasha, you know that's not right. Did you not read the court order? You have to. We have to. <laughs> no, no. I'm grown. I can do what I wanted to. So you telling me you willing to ruin the kids' Christmas just to hurt Chance? Yeah. He had no problem hurting us in court. His business made $3 million last year, and all we get is 800 Come on, let's go. Oh, oh come, come on. on. You want to see that too, right? Come on. His business has a lot of expenses, Monet. Yeah. The state did an audit. You know that. He manipulated those numbers, and you know that. Come on, come on. All Chance ever does is manipulate us and pin us against each other. You still living in the past. Why can't you accept the fact that Chance has changed? You're such a simp. Now, if I had Natasha, he's not getting back with you. He has a fiance. Hello? As a matter of fact, he's about to give her the life that he promised you. Now, don't you feel stupid for giving him the money to start his business? I don't. You see, there's a lot you don't know about Chance and I. What's that? Chance saved me. You know the day the cops showed up? Chance had already quit the scamming business. Chance took that charge just so Diamond wouldn't be born in prison. Giving him that money was the least I could do. That money wasn't yours to give. That was our Ours? Our money! What do you mean I ours? I should've known about that deal! He used you to play us, stupid! I'm stupid. But you're the fool! You're the fool! <laughs> Chance used that dirty money to provide a better life for our kids! Our kids! I ain't mad at him. Our kids deserve at least one stable parent. Are you that parent? And where are they anyway? Diamond! Diamond! Ronnie, where are you? I don't have time for this! Diamond! Listen, why were my children on the side Chance, of the road? It's not what you alone? think, Chance. What you mean is not what I think? Okay, I'm sorry, all right? They ran off. It was my fault. I just want my baby to be okay. So where, where are my children at now? She don't know. She won't tell us anything. What you mean you don't know? Daddy, you? Uh, you okay? Where's Ronnie? Daddy, I'm sorry, Daddy. I tried to say Ronnie, but the car came so fast. Baby, what were you doing? Where were you going? We were trying to get to your house. Why? I have joint custody now. And, and Miss Monet was going to bring you to my house to spend Christmas with me. I said she wasn't going to bring this. She didn't care what the judge said. 
Because you didn't deserve to see us for Christmas. But we really wanted to spend Christmas with you, Daddy. We almost made it, but then it got so dark. Diamond, I have to take you upstairs. No. I'll bring you right back. No. Okay, I'm gonna go. Son, baby, listen. I'm not going anywhere, okay? I'll be right here. It's hard to believe that you will go this far to hurt me. Nothing is open. It's not even the lives of our kids. It's not like that. Just listen. I understand that I hurt you. You know what I deserve? I deserve all the hatred and all the smoke that y'all could give to me. But please leave our children out of this. They are not meant to be weapons in your war against me. You see that your unforgiveness doesn't hurt me, it hurts my kids. It's my children. I almost got my son crushed by a speed vehicle because of this. Now listen. I know I deserve it. I deserve for you to hate me. From the pregnancy to the betrayal, Tasha, listen, I'm sorry. And Monet from prison. No! Listen, I'm begging y'all to forgive me. Please, y'all forgive me, please. Listen, listen, y'all. Y'all need to pull y'all step together. Now is not the time for this. At this moment, all y'all need to grow up and put your differences aside. In life, you don't always get what you deserve and what you desire. The only thing that should matter to y'all right now, this moment, are those kids. Those kids need y'all love right now. And that should be the only thing on y'all mind right now. Not no pain, no guilt, no revenge, no money. We need to all come together and agree that the only thing we want for Christmas is for those kids to be in the best health that they can possibly be in. Is that okay? No, I'm not convinced. What we need to do, we need to come together and pray. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Let's join hands. Come on. Girl. We should have did this long time ago. Father God, we thank you, Lord, for this moment. In your word, Lord, you said that wherever one or two are gathered in your name, you are there in the midst, Lord. Right now, Father, we ask that you give Ronnie a second chance. Give all these kids a second chance, Lord. Most importantly, Lord, we ask that you give us a second chance at being the best parents that we can possibly be. That we flow in our hearts with love, peace, and joy. And we're believing that you're performing this miracle right now as we speak. And we ask all of this in your son's precious name. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Let it be so. Yes. Yes. Oh, Ronnie is your son? Yes. How, how's he doing? Oh, um, he is stable. Ronnie suffered a concussion. He has a broken leg and a few cuts and bruises, but he's fine. I'm expecting a full recovery. Oh, oh my God. God. Thank you, Lord. Yes, Lord. Thank you. Can I see you, please? Oh, of course, yeah. Oh, God, so. <laughs> Thank you, Daddy. Of course. Oh, wait. Chance, can I talk to you for a second? Just a minute. It'll be quick. Um... Listen, I mean, listen, Gabriel, you don't have to explain anything to me. Okay, I understand why you're angry. But I should have just been honest with you. No, no, no. I wasn't honest with you. I lied when I said that I didn't want kids. I have always wanted children. I was just ashamed. Ashamed of what? I got pregnant by my college professor, and I didn't have insurance, so out of desperation, I got an abortion, a bootleg abortion, and it, it made me sterile. I dedicate my whole life to taking care of kids because I can't have I can't penalize you at all for my 
mistake that you made that changed your life forever because I made one of my own. Seems like our mistakes has brought us to God's perfect will for our lives, huh? Guess that's one way of looking at it. Well, listen, there we are. I know that there's more than one way for you to become a mother. I have two amazing, wonderful kids who are in need of a stepmom. Really? Really. Are you saying that I could have my ring back? <laughs> your ring? I don't know about that. <laughs> I don't know what Lazarus did with your ring. But what I am saying is, if you spend Christmas with me, I can form an introduce you to my family. I would really love that. But doesn't this look like good news? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Ah, listen, um, I'm kids. I'm good. Thank you. Okay. Hey, well, listen, sorry I couldn't be here sooner, but uh, you have got to take a look at this. What's going on, man? H and H home signed a contract. Are you serious, man? <laughs> Did you <laughs> uh, you get it? Man. You were clutching that in the Come on, man. Hey, bro, you gotta come to my house to celebrate for the Christmas. I can't. I will be in Aspen. Aspen and who, bro? Wife. I mean, call it a miracle. She changed her mind about the divorce, so. What? Gotta go. Gotta go. God is good. Man. Yeah, he is. I don't even know how to explain it. It's just, prayer really does change things, man. Point me in the direction to my God kids, man. You sure they're all right? Oh, yes, they're all right. Let me say hello to the big headed little kid you got. that I invited them over for our family gathering. Okay. Well, you know what? The healing has to begin at some point. By not Christmas. Mm -hmm. right. Well, ladies, how y'all doing today? This is nice. You've done well for yourself. Thank you. And you got all of this legitimately? <laughs> I got some for you. What's this? It's the seed money you gave me to start my business. Maybe you can use it to start yours. Legally. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Mm -hmm. I'm so proud of you, son. Merry Christmas to you. Merry Christmas. 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 What are you doing here? What do you mean, what am I doing here? Your mama told me she had a sweet potato pie for me. That's why I'm here. Lazarus! Hey, Mama Dog! <laughs> are you staying for dinner? Look what I have for you. <laughs> I would love to, but uh, I wasn't invited. Oh, oh. What a chance? No, I'm poor. Uh, Give me this pie, man. Huh? Go sit down. <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget it. 
can't wait to eat them dumplings back there with the sugar love and love and love and love and love How much y'all waiting on? Now you already know we need to pray first. Come on, everyone, bow your heads. All right. <laughs> Lord, we thank you, Lord, for this time that we all spent together and the second chance you gave us in your son, Jesus Christ. Good, amen. Father God, we also thank you for the family, the food, the friends, and the fellowship. And we also thank you, Lord, for everyone at this table that you've given everyone a second chance at life, love, and prosperity. Mm -hmm. Amen. And may your joy, peace, and love continue to cover all of them forever and ever and ever more. Amen. 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 Let's eat everybody. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I didn't see this coming. My past, my present, and my future together in the same room with no drama. <laughs> Thank you, God for giving me a second chance at fatherhood, friendship, and business. But God, since it is Christmas, I have one more request. Oh, everybody's gone. House is clean. It's just me and you. <laughs> you like that macaroni? Oh, so this belongs to you. If you still want. I do. <laughs> I do, huh? Mm -hmm. I like the way that sounds. <sighs> Baby. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I don't have a Christmas gift for you. I took it back. Oh, you took it back? I did. I thought I was going to be sad and lonely for Christmas. Oh, yes, I y'all do. I'm sorry. Oh, man. <laughs> that's, that's, that's just down bad. I can't believe you did that. <laughs> but even though I was sad and lonely myself, I still managed to get you a Christmas gift. You did? I did. I did. Where is it? Where it come from? I can't wait. It ain't on me. It's a surprise. So go ahead and close your eyes. <sighs> okay. Close your eyes. Okay. All right. They close. They close. I'm so excited. How many fingers am I holding on? Seven. Girl, go ahead. <laughs> Are you still having clothes? Huh? Yes, hurry up. Hey, girl. Oh, nah. I'm still in the shaky version of shit. I know. I'm about to peek. <laughs> you ready? Yep. Open. Oh my god, she is. Isn't she cute? She is adorable. So, what are you gonna name her? I'm gonna name her Hope because that's what you've given me. Mm -hmm. Little Hope. I know. Why right, Little Hope? How you doing? <laughs> See? It's more than one way for you to be a mom. You are such a sweetheart. Each one. Trying to tell me, tell me that I'm good without you. Just stay with the things that make you feel good. But I
get down, ayy. Got my squad, family, no one else around, ayy. I'm feeling blessed, so I give him thanks. We one of a kind, you cannot replace. God, I need no upgrade. He made us new, no update. And I'm hoping that you stick around me. To stay in the circle, we all connected, just like an Audi. When I feel like I'm going off of the rails, you keeping me grounded. You showing me love and taking me up. I'm glad that you found me, found me. Ain't nobody else gonna love me like you Not entertaining thoughts of the mysteries All the fairy tales All I want for Christmas is you mm -hmm.